I look at more art than I feel I can actually create myself. Um, and I look for just like that uniqueness in that artist and just trying to like get an idea of like who that person is and the decisions they make in their artwork. Um, that's, I don't know, that influences me a lot. Just the work that goes in behind um, the creation of a piece. Um, and then I try to, to try to emulate that and try to like emulate that with, from my own experience. My thoughts on racial equity now, it's, it's, it's about time. Um, it's, it's great to see. It's, it's, I see a conscious shift. Um, it seems like we're kind of going from diversity to, to the next step after diversity, where we, we look at who has an equal shot, who has the, the advantages and who has the disadvantages. And you know, now we're trying to address that and make, make it an even playing field so everyone um, can reach their, their full potential. Well, what I like about this community is that it holds like all of my childhood memories. I can look around, you know, and tell you a story about each little thing, each house around here. Um, I literally grew up running around here, playing in this park, um, playing basketball here. Um, and I've always wanted to do something like this here, you know, paint here and, and put up something in, in the community that I grew up in. Um, so it's, it's, to me, it's, this community is my childhood. It's also extremely diverse. I grew up with all people from all different backgrounds um, growing up. You know, there was just a huge group of us that was, we were all different. We all came from different backgrounds and I always loved that about this community.